Shiba Inu price action is coming to a head right now and is liable to break out very soon. But which direction are we heading? Here we are on the TradeConfident.io website. And before we get started, let me know what you had for lunch today. I always enjoy interacting with you guys. And if you enjoy this video, please like and subscribe for more crypto content, education, and analysis. Getting started now and scrolling down to Shiba Inu. Now, the emotional index here is going to be the window inside the mind of crypto traders. It'll help you anticipate what traders are feeling. Shiba Inu traders are feeling fairly neutral right now. And this isn't surprising. I mean, check out this pattern. The price is getting less and less volatile over time. And because of that, traders really don't know how to feel. And I think the next couple of days are going to be really crucial for SHIB. Next up is Shiba Inu long versus short trades and long and short trades make up the meat of the market. Seeing right here that long trades have dropped a little bit, but begun moving back into the market shows me that we could be seeing some bullish price movement soon. Now, in order to win in cryptocurrency, you need to be trading with the whales and the whale smart money metric is going to help you see whale trader sentiment. We were in long trade sentiment for some time and it looks like we could be moving towards short trade sentiment soon. But again, we'll have to see. We have to break out of this pattern very, very soon and we need to be paying attention before we can really make any judgments on this chart. On the volatility breakout detector, we've seen a steady decline in volatility as price action has gotten smaller and smaller in its movements. However, volatility is beginning to rise up and what this tells me is we could be seeing a breakout soon. Now, support and resistance is the foundation of technical analysis and the major support and resistance metric is going to help you keep track of that. As of this morning, we were testing structure resistance at, and I'm going to just use the last four digits here, at 1295. Now we do have a little bit of structure support right here, but the next lowest marked structure support is going to be 1016. So that's where I'm going to be wanting you guys to pay attention to in case we do break downwards. However, if we break to the upside, I think 1518 will be the next closest structure resistance. Last but not least is the Shiba Inu daily trade scanner. While I don't expect to see a signal as we break out of this triangle pattern, I think once it does break out, whether it's the upside, we will see a sell signal. And if it breaks out to the downside, we'll be looking for a buy signal for the next move. So be paying attention there. Now, if you want to get access to all of these metrics across 20 cryptocurrencies and you want to get our brand new trade setups, check it out right here. We have brand new trade setups for you on the tradeconfident.io website. And the current record is two wins zero losses. Now, if you saw my Bitcoin video this morning, you know that we could actually be heading up pretty quickly here. And if we do, we're going to have multiple winners happening very, very quickly. So if you want to get access to these scalping trades and join us in our trades, be sure to check out the links in the description below. Just click show more and you're going to want to click the first link right here. And once you do that, it'll bring you to the membership page. I would recommend the full access membership for $59 a month. This is what includes all 20 coins worth of metrics, as well as those scalping scalping trade calls. If you are a full access member, always be on the lookout for Wisdom Wednesday and future forecast videos as this is members only content that you need to be paying attention to. Go down here, click subscribe now, follow the prompts and we hope to trade with you soon. And with that, let's check out the live charts. Here we are looking at Shiba Inu on the one day time frame. You can see the symmetrical triangle pattern that has developed since early February. Right now, the price versus well money flow and the trend exhaustion are directly in the middle of their charts on the one day time frame. And the same goes for the four hour here. We have the price versus well money flow high relative to the rest of the chart, but still in the middle with the trend exhaustion still in the middle as well after we peaked right about here to meet structure resistance on the symmetrical triangle pattern. Now a breakout is imminent. I mean, we can only get so far before we break out of this triangle pattern. And if you watch my Bitcoin video this morning, you'll know this, but essentially the only way I'm judging the cryptocurrency market right now is whether or not we stay above or below below this ascending support level on the S&P 500. If we stay above this, if the price begins moving up on the S&P 500 and this support right here stays as support, I think she will be more likely to break out to the upside. However, if the S&P 500 breaks down below this structure support and this becomes resistance, I think it'll be very difficult for she not to break to the downside. The other thing I'm gonna be paying attention to is the fact that on the four hour time frame here, the price versus well money flow has just now begun moving down with the the trend exhaustion having topped out and begun moving down again. This tells me that we could have more room to move to the downside. However, if we move up and retest structure resistance right here, I'm going to be looking for the price versus well money flow to be low and the trend exhaustion to be low. If that happens, if we get those two signals while we're testing structure resistance, 
that is a very likely break out to the upside. So it's gonna be difficult to call. Pay attention to the SPY, pay attention to the indicators right here as we test structure resistance and support. And before we get into final price predictions, I'll let you know you can actually get these indicators for $400 off right now. And let me show you how to do that. Again, go ahead and look for the links in the description, scroll down and click show more, and it's going to be the second link right here. Go ahead and click that. It'll bring you to our indicator page and this $400 off coupon is available to anyone that purchased the bundle pack right here. It'll take you to our indicator page and the $400 off coupon is available to anyone that purchases the bundle pack. Now the trend exhaustion and the price versus well money flow are included in the bundle pack and this is what I use to really judge breakouts. It'll also include seven other indicators. And again, that $400 off coupon for the TC top and bottom finder here. Purchasing all indicators with that coupon code will be cheaper than just buying the TC top and bottom finder alone. So what are you waiting for? It is lifetime access, one-time payment with full dedicated email support. If you ever have any questions, please feel free to email us at btradeconfident at gmail.com. And with that, let's check out the price predictions. Back on the live charts here, I'm looking at SHIB USD on the four hour time frame. Let's get into some price predictions. Now, if we drop down, if we break down out of this symmetrical triangle pattern, the first place I'll be looking at is major structure support right here at 1200. If we get big moves, and I honestly think this is less likely to happen, but if we do get that, I think the next move down would be 1120. However, if the S&P 500 begins moving up and we move up in SHIB, the first structure resistance will be right about here, both at the local top right here here and the descending resistance here at 1287. From there, I think 1327 would be the move up if we fully broke out of the triangle. Now, unfortunately, I understand that this is a fairly vague prediction, but overall, just be looking for the S&P 500, whether or not it's going to break up or down, and whatever happens there will very likely translate to she. Based on what happens on the S&P 500, be sure to pay attention to structure supports and resistances, whichever one is relevant at the time. With that, thanks so much for watching. Trade safe, trade confident, and I'll see you in the next video.